It's a real honor and privilege to come and pack, um, be your hands and feet. And um, it's just amazing to see how God is working in this ministry. We're so glad that you have a heart for this ministry. We know that it's not always, you're always able to pack, but that's what we're here for. It's such a nice thing to have such a great and supportive team that will do this on a Friday night in, after Hurricane. <laughs> and um, I'm just so thankful for each one of you here and for making the effort. Really, just such a privilege to come out and minister to Celia and her family and just that she has such a heart for you, Lord, and she wants to pack boxes and she's just not able to, Lord. And I just thank you that we can be your hands and her feet this year that we can just show her your love, that you care so much about her, and even the little things like packing a shoebox, that we can be here for her. Last year, we wanted to participate in the uh, or, uh, children's Christmas uh, boxes, and the church wasn't prepared to do that. So I talked to the pastor. There was a lot of good reception in it. Um, and Jan and, and the group here suggested we have a packing party for Celia. Uh, my purpose to have it this year uh, was because my wife has an illness and she really missed doing it. She's done it for 25 years. Um, and last year, because we changed churches, we weren't involved. And when we first came here, we thought they were going to do it, and they didn't do it. So this year, we, we got it started again. Um, Gary was a phone contact that I got from Barbara. So he had called in wanting somebody to come and talk to the church. And so it fell to me, and I came, and I did the presentation here at Gary's church. And in doing the presentation and talking with Gary, I found out about Sia and how much she wanted to pack boxes. And so I told my Barbara Westerbeck, my... Uh, area coordinator about Celia and Barbara came up with the idea to have a packing party here for Celia here at this church. So that's how it all came about. I'm the area coordinator for the Alabama Georgia Wiregrass area team and Jan is my ministry coordinator for church relations and when she told me about Celia's desire to pack we thought we could do this. We could have our own packing party for her and we could be her hands and her feet. Our goal was 25 but I think we're going to get 50 tonight. And this local area team, Alabama Georgia Wiregrass team, is rocking it. They have are contributing to our national goal of 9.4 million shoeboxes. Globally, Operation Christmas Child seeks to collect 11 million shoeboxes all the week of November 12th through the 19th, which is our national collection week, and then distribute them in countries all over the world. Father, right now, we pray specifically for every child that's going to receive 
box of God, that you will just transform their hearts and their minds and their bodies, Father. That the gifts in the box are exactly what they would pray for, Father God. That it will not only give them joy, Lord God, but it will be the opportunity for them to come to know you as their personal Savior. Let's reach out to each one all over, Father, and give them the opportunity to know you. We know that when all the children in the world know your name, they know who you are. They know all the world. And all the world is so small. And we all say, Amen! Now, more work, but to get them to the car. Ah!